Karnataka and Maharashtra chief ministers met Union Home Minister Amit Shah today. The meeting went on for half an hour. After that, the Union Home Minister came out and addressed the media and he announced that three big decisions have been taken in this meeting. First was that it is a matter which needs to be solved constitutionally. It cannot be solved on road through protest. So he appealed to people uh, in both the states to, you know, stay calm and the matter would be decided by the Supreme Court. Until then, both the states cannot have have any kind of claim on on those villages which are being claimed by both the states uh, either by uh, and belgavi is one of them uh, the karnataka and maharashtra the status quo will rem remain uh, the second big decision was that uh, from both the states, three uh, ministers would be uh, coming together, three from Karnataka and three from Maharashtra. And this committee would look into each and every aspect to the last detail, to the ground detail. And then that matter would be discussed between them. The third big decision was and a senior IPS officer would be deputed because due to this, there were some clashes reported from both the states. Uh, so the law and order was a big issue and due to which some people who were travelling from Maharashtra to Karnataka or from Karnataka to Maharashtra were facing some problems and even trader community was facing some problem. So this IPS officer, the senior IPS officer with, would, which would be appointed would be looking into the law and order issue concerning these two states so that traders and the travellers do not face any kind of problem. And the third big uh, decision uh, which was taken in this meeting was that all those Twitter handles which were tweeting about what kind of a situation is there on the ground and how the law and order situation is deteriorating, those fake Twitter handles would be dealt as per law, a FIR would be registered. This is the big statement coming out of this meeting. In fact, the Union Home Minister also stated that some Twitter handles you know, were uh, made in the name of some ministers also and they were tweeting some fake information. So now he has given a go-ahead that both the states should lodge complaints, should lodge FIRs against those Twitter handles and take, um, uh, take the decision to deal with them legally. So these are few, three, four aspects which came out of this meeting and he also appealed to the opposition to keep calm. He said this matter needs to be dealt constitutionally and he as a home minister is appealing to the uh, to the opposition parties in both the states that politically uh, you know they should not uh, color this uh, situation which is which is a very volatile situation as far as these two states are concerned so even the political parties should keep calm and wait for the supreme court decision in new delhi with camera person kanan patra this is neeta sharma reporting for ndtv